Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel. I don't know if you've been here before or not, but if you haven't, hi. If you have, hi. Hi everyone. Um, today I am doing Henley's four month update. It does appear that I'm sitting here by myself, but Henley is actually right over here. What was that? <laughs> Making yourself known. She is having a lot of fun in her swing right now, and I'm hoping she continues to have fun and actually lets me complete this video. So Henley has been four months old for a while now. <laughs> you were so silly. And she is the happiest baby ever, still. I don't know if you've watched my previous updates on her, but she's still just super smiley, super happy, super active all the time. <laughs> and she's just laughing so much right now, it's really hard to focus. So, four months old. I still can't believe it. And this has always been, like, the gateway for all of my kids. She is my third girl. And it always seemed like at four months old, that's whenever my kids, like really take off developmentally like they just start doing everything all of a sudden and it's crazy it's really crazy like everything just goes so fast now from this point and that's definitely kind of ringing true for for Henley I don't even know what she's laughing at. I think she's laughing at me talking to myself which I don't blame her it's kind of funny that's definitely been true for Henley she has started doing so many things now that she's four months old, it's all just happening so fast, and so I tried to list out everything for you guys on my phone, um, but I may be forgetting things just because I feel like she has new firsts every single day. <laughs> she's just smiling away. Okay, so she did have her four-month appointment yesterday. I think it was yesterday, or maybe it was no, it was definitely the day before yesterday. All my days are running together. That's the life of a mom for you. And she was 16 pounds even, which is absolutely insane for me. I feel like that's huge. I don't know if that's huge, but I feel like that's huge. She is definitely mostly in six month clothing. She can still fit in some of her three month clothes, but mostly six months at this point. She's also in size three diapers, and I was definitely in denial for that for a really long time. I kept her in size twos for probably way longer than she needed to be, but it's just really hard for me to accept that my four month old is already in size three diapers. I mean, my two year old is wearing size four diapers, and that's just crazy. Like, she's not supposed to be that big. But she definitely is, and she definitely fills out her size 3 diapers, and I have learned to accept it. She is not sleeping through the night anymore. If you watched my last update, I was low-key bragging on my baby sleeping through the night, because she was. She is no longer sleeping through the night, and I am not totally sure if that is because she's having her four month sleep regression which is the most likely cause but it also might be because she stayed a week oh my god she stayed a week in the hospital in the ICU for RSV at the beginning of December and they would come in and wake her up like every two hours oh my god She's so freaking loud. They would come in and wake her up every two to three hours to do breathing treatments and to check on her vitals and everything. So it kind of seemed like after she spent that week in the hospital is whenever she stopped sleeping through the night. So like I said, it could be from sleep regression. It also could be from being in the hospital. I'm not really sure. But at this point, I feel like I'm not sleeping at all. Like, not at all. We wake up so many times through the night, I feel like I just get sleep in hour-long increments, if that. And I'd say I'm maxing at like three hours a night. Max. It sucks. I feel like this swing is really loud. Let's move it. Wow, what a difference. So sorry for the first half of this video where that swing is like making the worst noise ever. I just fixed it. She can roll over. I know she has done it. I've seen her do it. She does not do it very often though, at least not a full 180. 
Definitely not full 360, but she mostly just ends up on her side, and I think she just enjoys being on her side. I know for a fact that she hates being on her tummy. Always has, probably always will. So she usually will make it from tummy to back pretty quickly, but other than that, she just goes from back to side or tummy to side, usually ends up on her side. She is trying to sit up on her own, not quite there yet. I don't expect that she'll be there yet for another month at least, but she has gained amazing head control and it definitely shows when we're trying to get her to sit up. We got her a little chair for Christmas that allows her to start working on that. So we should be there sooner than later. She has definitely found her feet, which is one of my most favorite things that babies do. Let's turn that down a notch. Her toys are her toys. Her feet are her favorite toys now. It's adorable. She's constantly grabbing at her feet, putting them in her mouth, just loves her feet. She's also actually playing with her toys now. And by play, I mean like grabbing them and putting them in her mouth and stuff like that. But she's actually showing interest in her toys. And her favorites are her Sophie draft. Um, I wish I had it in here to show you guys, but that little plastic draft that everybody gets for their kids. I think it's made by Infantino or something. It's called the Sophie Draft. She loves it. And this Soothe Draft pacifier. She's had this since birth and she has never really used it as a pacifier. Still doesn't. But now she really likes to play with it and she likes to gnaw on it and put it in her mouth and stuff like that. Goodness. And she's getting really jealous of the camera getting all the attention. So she's gonna be in the video. Hi, baby. Let's try to get both of us. I don't know if I can make that work. Hold on. We got big heads. Say hi. She grabs at absolutely everything. I can no longer eat my food with her in my lap because she is always grabbing at my bowls or my plates or whatever and she gets food all over her hands causes a lot of interruptions to my meal time her nails are growing crazy fast and i'm pretty sure that's genetic because my hair and nails are always growing really fast and so do her sisters but she's grabbing at everything with her crazy growing nails and my chest definitely looks like i'm either cutting myself or having some crazy abusive sex so <laughs> I'm not, I swear, it's my baby's nails. I mean, y'all don't really need to know anything about what happens behind closed doors, right? But it's from her nails. Other than that, she is a total sweetheart. She is the sweetest, cutest, most precious baby in the world. She makes it extremely hard not to try for another baby already, but I am going to soak in these, these few remaining months where she is my baby before she becomes a little toddler and it's just happening way faster than I'm ready for. But she's super sweet, super smiley. She hardly ever cries, right? And she's just super smiley. Pretty much anyone that sees her on a regular basis will tell you that they've never heard her cry. And that is most likely true. She rarely cries. But when she does, she can definitely let it out. She's got the lungs. She's just, she's just got a sweet temperament. <laughs> Anyways, that is all for Henley's four month updates. And we just love her so much. And we are so blessed to still have her here because like I mentioned before, she did spend a week, an entire week in ICU. And I can tell you guys, I've never been so scared in my entire life, I really thought that I was gonna lose my baby. And there were many times where, like I said, I was just so scared that she wasn't gonna make it. And she's still here, and she's still so happy. And I'm just so blessed. I'm so blessed to have her still here with me. So, anyways, that is it for this update, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Yay! And we will probably be doing the next update sooner than later, so. She was growing so fast. You getting sleepy head? You ready for a nap? I think someone's definitely ready for a nap. You say bye bye, guys. Say I'm going nine nights now. Bye, guys.